This week on In the Kitchen with Pete, we're doing a simple and delicious breakfast casserole. Nothing like a simple breakfast casserole. Everything all in one dish. Now my lovely neighbor Sharon dropped by this big old bag of breakfast hash. Now there's all sorts of different makes. This one has some peppers and bacon, but even just the plain type of breakfast hash, whether they're finely diced or chunked, will work for this recipe. It's an all-in-one dish. You can cook it up the day before. It's delicious. You're going to love it. Let's get to it. In the frozen section at your local grocer, you can choose your frozen hash potatoes. All sorts of brands. Pick whichever one you like, it'll all work. There's nothing high tech here in this recipe. A little dash of this and a little sprinkle of that and get creative, make it your own. We'll be using a 10 by seven baking dish. Give it a light coating of cooking spray or spread a little olive oil around the dish. And then we'll add our three cups of hash browns. Into the oven at 425 for 25 to 30 minutes, stirring them halfway through. When they come out, sprinkle them with a little grated cheese. Then we'll add our six to eight well beaten eggs that have been seasoned with salt and pepper and spread that around evenly. On top of that, we'll sprinkle one cup of diced ham and a third of a cup of finely diced onions. Then we'll top that with a little more grated cheese. That's your choice, whatever your favorite cheese is. Now it's into the oven, 425, 10 to 12 minutes. You'll know it's done when it comes out nice and golden brown like this. Doesn't that look delicious? Easy to serve and it's delicious that day or the day after. It's great, hot or cold. You're gonna love it. Well, that was another simple and delicious recipe. I hope you get to try it out with your friends and family. And if you like it, I have over 150 recipes on YouTube to date. Check them out. I think you'll love them. And don't forget to subscribe. Hit that little red subscribe button down below. You'll get notified every time I post a new video. Thanks for coming out and watching In the Kitchen with Pete. Until next time, see ya!